we should understand geology because we should understand our home. Our home has riches and limitations. It is a mature science. It's the understanding of the earth, but it's also utilizing that understanding in the service of humankind. It's such a philosophical subject. Geology talks about origins. Where did the earth come from? Where did life come from? Etc. We ask these questions all the time. And I say to the students, you're not just UT students, we're not just scientists, we are total human beings. As a student at the Jackson School, I feel like I've had the chance to do it all. Whether it's undergraduate research, whether it's service in the community, or student leadership, the quality of the faculty and students that compete to get in is just incredibly high. We're trying to be the best in the world at what we do. We set the bar really high here, and I think everybody knows that. Well, I chose to go to the Jackson School because I love geology, I, I love science, I, I wanted to get outdoors, and uh, Austin's such a great place to live, and I felt like geology was an opportunity to let me get out of the office, maybe not have a conventional career. And there's nothing better than going to work every day and using something that you really love to do. The growth in the school has been tremendous. Just the physical facility has grown, the programs, the teaching, the research that's really unparalleled in, in any other place in the country and probably in the world. When the Jackson School became established, the number of students who would come to UT as freshmen stating that they wanted to major in geology you could count on the fingers of two hands. Suddenly, that increased about tenfold. Boom! Here you are a little fish in a big pond, and the big pond has so much to offer. The alumni of the Jackson School are leaders in government, research, and in the private sector at a national level, if not global level. A lot of the connections I've made that I continue to benefit from today started right here in Austin. And I think that's unique. I think the fellowship and the camaraderie among the faculty and the students and now the alumni is, is, is very tangible and you can feel it. And you feel like you're part of something greater than yourself. When I was 20, I had the chance to spend a summer working at an oil company, get some real good hands-on experience mapping and understanding the exploration process. After that summer, I was completely hooked on geology. Right now, I'll be spending my summer out at the Bureau of Economic Geology at the Pickle Campus. Part of our core purpose is to literally define the geosciences. And what's gonna happen is that many different fields will be combined in ways they've never been combined. And that's where new knowledge will be created. We are biologists, we are chemists, we are physicists, we are mathematicians, and so forth, applying all of these to the earth. And so that alone is going to make the subject of geology to be extremely diverse. Teaching as opposed to research, I've done both, but the teaching has gotten my first priority. You know, I'm ending my 48th year. I will have taught 30,000 students. I love it. I love it. Because we've grown so much in terms of our undergraduate enrollment, we're looking to build an additional student center. We'll have a place to meet and organize. It's just going to increase how well connected all the students are in a huge way. State funding is down here at the university and it's been felt across the board. But because of the generosity of our donors and our alumni and the many people that support us, we're able to keep our pace up. Where other institutions have cut their programs back, the Jackson School is expanding their programs. And it takes time and effort and money to do that. We want to make sure those programs are safe and guaranteed. And I feel compelled to give back to the place that really started my business career. The quality of the faculty here and the depth of resources here will enable these students to work on the biggest, most important issues of our day. Where are we going to get our energy? Where are we going to get our unconventional energy? How do we protect our environment, our groundwater? Questions like that are going to be answered by these students today and the incoming students in the future. What are the hazards? What is, what's climate going to do in the near and distant future? What sort of jeopardy are we in? Geologists have a very practical application. There's problems that we'll face that we've never had to face before as we populate more areas that we never have before. We put more stress on our environment. We're trying to put geology together with everything else that we believe that's important in our lives. I'm passionate about that. 
I didn't think I was going to get this chance before I went to grad school, and I'm amazed that I got it. I'm going to be looking at graduate schools here in another year, and my number one choice is staying here. The power of that degree is recognized in the marketplace, and it's carried me and benefited me throughout my career, and, and I, I do feel fortunate and very grateful. I'm so thankful. I, I, I guess that's all I can say. I'm thankful for the opportunity. I completely redefine how I think about the Earth. It's not going to be too long before we completely change the way we think about our planet and, and how it supports us. In the long run, what it means is that we're going to change the way we live and interact with our environment. The Earth sciences are going to have a lot to do with that.